Welcome back everyone. We are doing another video um, that talks about chickens and what it all is and what it means to take care of them. How hard it is, what they require. So here is my chickens. And today, I wanted to talk about egg layering. Before that, I want to give them a little snack. Let's see. So, what I gave them is cantaloupe wedges, mango, so it's basically just fruits and vegetables. So, while that's going on, I want to go and see how many eggs they laid today. How did we do? And it's pretty hot here, so sometimes we don't get as many eggs. So this is the coop. We use these scrubs for the water. See the water? So we change it every two days. So we'll just dump it, clean it up, and then fill it up with water again. So, oh, I got three eggs. Oh, four. Ooh, today's a good day. Okay, so out of six chickens, sometimes they do one, two, it really depends. So, um, and because we have this modified with the runner, I cannot get the eggs from where you'd normally get. So I just take from the top. I will just take them, put them there, and then take the other two, put them here. And yes, I'm handling them with my hands. Um, if you know anything about chicken eggs, um, if you leave them unwashed, they will last a long time and you don't have to refrigerate them. Even though they tell you to wash them. Um, so because it is hot, um, the heat will influence how many eggs you get and how high, how, how many, often the chickens will lay eggs, right? So that's an effect. Um, chickens do require, they're not vegetarian, so they do require um, protein. So like here is their regular food. She's eating regular food. Like I'd mentioned to another another video, we buy it at Tractor Supply Store. I'm sure there are better places where you can get chicken food. Unfortunately, where we are, that seems to be the most convenient. I do give them organic chicken food, so that's at least helpful. And because my chickens are pretty much all day, they roam around here. We have it fenced with uh, Premier fencing. If you know anything about Premier fencing. So it's fenced, um, but they do roam around. They eat the worms in the ground. They have grass, stretch their legs. So that's very helpful. Um, another thing you might want to know about the eggs is as it gets cooler, they lay less. So the best, from my perspective, from my experience, the best laying times is spring and fall, when it's neither too hot or too cold. So the only times, back to the washing of the eggs, we wash them when, they're, when they have stuff on them. But like today, they're pretty clean eggs. So you don't have to wash them. Um, 
I pretty much use all the eggs or um, I give them to family and friends if I have any additional. But not every week I have extra eggs. Um, and the size of the eggs can vary as you see. These are pretty decent size, but sometimes they are smaller. But this is pretty decent. And they are all different colors. See how cute they are. And they love the little treat, fruits and vegetable treat. And the reason summers, if it's not too hot, they'll produce a lot is because the daylight. As the days are longer, they produce more eggs. They lay more eggs. So whether you're raising chickens for eggs or just you like their company, enjoying their company, um, it's important to understand their behavior and what's normal behavior for the chickens. And to, to, you can spot if something is off or something is going on with it. So if you found this video helpful, please like the contact the thumbs up and subscribe if you'd like to know more about how to raise chickens the easy way see you on the next video